Hey guys, my name is Stanley and I'm from RC Tank Legion. Thank you for watching my channel. So today after a long hiatus from making unboxing videos, today we are finally going to be unboxing the latest Hang Long Tank. Guess what it is? So let's check out what it is. The Bakava Mark IV. Okay, so finally Hanglong has released a new model called the Bakava Mark IV and it is the new model in a long long time since their last offering which is the T72 and so without further ado let's open it up as usual it comes with the instruction manual the decals okay comes with let me see Let's see. Okay, we got all the plastic bits, the transmission knob, the usual shitty USB charger, and yeah, USB charger, IR receiver, box of BBs, more plastic bits with. The, uh, the details and check it out I see gold color uh, ammunition um, belt oh very nice photo etch parts with screws and mesh and ah, quite a lot of details from Hang Long okay and more details parts okay on to the main menu wow it is a big tank okay it is a version 7 instruction manuals as usual at the battery cover Uh, metal suspension arms Okay, very nice Just like the real tank front front engine front wheel drive mm. okay, Let's see Let's see for any hatches mm. Okay, commander hatch for sure. Okay, commander hatch is where you put your IR receiver This looks like a mount for something could be the machine gun. Is there any more hatches that we can open? Um, I think I can see. Oh, this is interesting. Usually, the when you turn the turret. You can feel the uh, the clutch engaging, but this time the motor is turning with it. So maybe the the way they made it is different now. But you, I can still hear the clutch engaging. Okay, the driver's hatch can be open, and that's where your on/off switch is. Yep. Okay. Oh, oh, this hatch looks like can be open. What is this? Hmm, is there? Is there a latch or something? Not sure, but it, that seems to be able to be opened. Okay, so let me uh, give it a try. Okay. Oh, what the? Okay, so to open the battery latch, there is a you have to open the driver's hatch, and there is a little latch here that re removes the hatch over here, 
and the battery is inside. And the nice thing about um, Henglong tanks now, they all come with X60, no more shitty Tamiya uh, connectors. Okay, so I'm gonna put on the battery and see how this works out. Okay, as usual, it 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 blinks the lights, so you know it's um, switched on. Press the stop button, and we have the Abrams of turbine sound. Anyways. <laughs> Okay, we got the recoiling barrel, bow and arrow action. Okay, and, uh, let's, let's turn on the volume. Coming out from here, the exhaust. You can see. So you press G and K change the engine sound, it will, it will uh, switch off, and then you turn on again. So now we have the. Uh, So I'm, not, I'm just gonna give you a brief uh, description of what you can do, um, but I think most of you guys who have the the version seven tanks would know. So you can fine tune uh, the the left and right. The the trim tabs on the radios are, are fake. It doesn't actually move. What you need to do, you press G and then uh, steering uh, input to get to fine tune your left and right. Hang on, G one is backward fine tuning. G two is forward fun tuning and G plus 2 is uh, forward and backward adjustment oh yeah there's lights you can play with you can uh, adjust loading action up down volume okay you, 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 you adjust the volume pressing V like so all the way up for maximum volume all the way down that's the new one Okay, turret speed adjustment now. This is new. Let's turn on the volume. Okay, now it's really slow. Let's go all the way up to the right. I think it's the fastest. All the way down again. I can't really tell the difference. Is there a difference? I can't tell. Okay. Uh, off recoil. AS.
okay, you can turn on and off the hover coil. Second machine gun KFA. So you can change the, the machine gun sound. Okay, okay. Another sound. GB. This is for instant fire instead of uh, BB gun. So let's see. So yeah, it takes away the very funny uh, bow and arrow action. I want to be like this. And Drake Rack level, double current, driver skill, sound effect, launch, and restore. Oh, basically, at the very last, there is a uh, reset. If you forget all your settings, there's a reset uh, setting as well. Overall, this is a very interesting new tank. Uh, it looks well built. The quality of the plastic looks nice. The texture is also pretty nice if you can see the texture. Okay, they actually molded the texture in. As usual, the uh, don't expect hobby grade quality paint. It's uh, hang long after all. Uh, I feel the plastic is nice, you know. Uh, as usual, again, um, very well made from, from hang long. All the blinking lights. Okay, so for the price, it is actually a pretty decent buy compared to uh, the Huben Makava. But Huben Makava is nice, lots of details, but uh, you can't get a, another Makava for this price. So this is actually a good one. You can get it from our rctanglegion.com uh, shop uh, online. Uh, it's very limited. Okay, this concludes today's unboxing video of Henglong's latest tank, which is the Makava Mark IV. I hope you enjoyed today's video, and uh, I'm sorry guys for the long hiatus between all this uh, for the long times, because I've been really busy with work. So until the next video, please like, share, and subscribe. Thank you for watching.